the walker? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> you want to just start with it? I'll start with it. Wait, can I just be like, oh, can I use the podium after? Okay, yeah. yeah, or if you want to walk to after your first main point or after your transition and grab the podium okay. seamlessly, we'll never even know this. We'll just know what you're doing, okay? Okay. All right, huh? Whenever you're we're ready. Okay, hey everybody. I'm Delisa Madeer. And basically, there's four in my family. There's me, my brother, my dad, and my mom, obviously. And we have like a lot of pets at home. And I, in my talk, I'm gonna talk about how my family has basically shaped me into who I am today. And so in order for you to get to know me better, I'm gonna talk about how I chose my major and my passion. So, first, my major is biology. Okay. Okay, <laughs> let's hold on to this one. Let's grab that podium. I'm going to grab it. And I am only saying that because of, um, yeah, and then we'll put it down a bit. You may. Should I take it off? No, no, no. I'm not sure. <laughs> no, no, no. Is that too short? Mm, you may want it like a half inch okay. more. Yeah, and I know it's so silly that it's it perfect. That's your spot. Okay, good. Now, take that foot of yours, one of them, and push it on the podium. Perfect. And your energy is going to go into that foot. But make sure you're grounding yourself. Let's go ahead and go into that first transition. Should I say the pieces again? Sure. Okay. So in order for you to get to know me better, I'm going to talk about how I ch chose my major and my passion. So first, my main point, my major is biology, and how it came to be. So I wasn't like I wasn't always going to be a bio major. I had no idea what I was going to do with my life. But I mean, in my background, I had like a whole bunch of pets at home. So I thought, hey, I love pets. I want to keep working with them. And so I think it wasn't until like the seventh grade when I first got my dog that I knew that I wanted to like work with animals in the future. And I, in the future, I have no idea still what I'm going to do, but it's, it's going to be dealing with pets somehow. And my family has shaped me for this, like, major because they're always, like, so hardworking and generous, and I feel like the same, I feel the same that I have to be generous to something. And so I chose animals as something to give my time, my dedication to. Perfect. And now, let's keep those hands off the podium. Off the podium. There you go. You can put them there. Per, you can put them on the, the bottom of the podium. Perfect. Now, why don't you go ahead and tell us right there the way that my parents influenced my major, that's where I want you to start from, and say it without using the word like. Oh, I didn't even know what it says there. Okay. Even if you have to say the sentence like this, go for it. Slow it down really slow in order to say it without that word. So do I start over? Nope. Start it at the part with your parents influenced this major. Okay. So my parents influenced my major because they are always so hardworking and generous, and I feel I have to be the same way by giving my time to, to other either other people or other things. In this case, I chose animals, and I just love them. So I'm going to do that in the future. And also, along with future, comes to my second point, which is my passion, and it's dance. And when I was younger, I didn't, I wasn't like one of those other girls where like you get to, you have to be put in like a dance class. I was put in baseball with my brother, and it was a lot of fun, but it just wasn't me. And I feel like, like in middle school, no, like, in middle school, I started to dance a lot, and I, I just loved, fell in love with it, and I, and it's helped me like to express myself and I feel like really grown in high school because I was like on the dance I was on the dance team and I'm going to continue dance in the future and it's one of my major my minors it is my minor and I'm going to be yeah doing that in the future and in closing I just want to thank you all for listening to this little short in introduction about me and my major and my passion Good. With this, let's try the that second part about dance again. Let's try coming to the side of this podium and holding.
the paper in one hand, and then why don't you take, yep, do that, and now take that, there you go, there you go. And you can even pop it a little. All right, now, let's just say, give me a couple lines from that last part. Okay. Can I just start it over then with the... Conclusion? Oh, wait, am I doing conclusion? You can do the conclusion for me. Oh, okay. Well, thank you all for listening to my talk and listening about why I chose my major and my passion. Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out your swaying like this up at the top. I thought that grounding our foot would maybe do it, but maybe now I need you to push your elbow in. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, that may ground you a little bit more as well. Let some of that energy out. Why'd you like dance? I like dance because it's fun and I can really like express myself through it and I can show my story what people are watching. Okay. All right, good. So we'll work on yeah, this. I'm going to come up with an, an idea as as well. And it may be, hmm, yeah, I need, to, I need to think this one through. But thank you for telling us that. I, too, love dance. Yeah. All right, animal, the animals. All right, everybody, let's give her a clap.